Hey guys, so we are back to regular scheduled programming. <laughs> um, so Noah is here today because he had a fever yesterday. I don't know if he has the flu or whatever. There's the flu, strep, and the stomach bug is going around in our area. So today, Matt actually took off today. Um, look at this. I'm going to start. I break out so bad. Like, I can feel it, like, when I move. Oh, my camera. Okay. I'm going to just, like, throw my camera. All right. So, I'm trying to, like, get ahead of myself. You don't need to see, like, all of my self. <laughs> I'm trying to get ahead of the game here. I'm trying to focus on eating lots of more vegetables, so I'm going to cut and prep them all ahead of time so that I don't have to worry about it when I'm fixing my lunch or if I'm not eating what they're having for dinner. I can just grab a handful of the veggies and toss them in the air fryer and let them go. So Matt went to the bank. Um, I'm going to attempt to do air fryer um, refried beans. This is so crazy. Like I thought about it yesterday. I don't like pinto beans. Like. I don't know if it's like a southern thing, but like people make a pot of pinto beans, we call them beans, and then people just eat them with like raw onion and like mustard and I don't know what else they eat them with. I don't like it like that, but I love refried beans. So Taco Bell has a cheesy bean and rice burrito. So I think I'm just going to recreate that. I might make some brown rice. The rice I really could care less about, but just doing like um, the little low carb wraps with the refried beans and some cheese maybe i can maybe throw in some vegetables if i wanted to but like something simple that i would want to eat that's what i'm thinking so i'm going to cut up a bunch of these i have broccoli i got them yesterday i have sweet potatoes i do not like sweet potatoes like i've come to a part of my life where i'll just settle for it and just eat it um i've seen a couple people or a couple things about um using radishes as like a potato i'm gonna try i'm gonna like cut them up and then see what they taste like in the air fryer and then i always get lettuce and then i cut it up and put it in here um we are going to have asian le lettuce wraps asian chicken lettuce wraps tonight which i'm super excited about um so yeah so i'm gonna get to cutting up then we'll clean up something and ew there's water Okay. So we've got broccoli, cucumbers, and these are things that I can eat. Well, I can eat these raw. I don't think I ever, I don't know if I've really liked those before, but <laughs> um, so I put them in my mother-in-law, like I just got these. My mother-in-law and father-in-law eat at Waffle House a lot, as you can see. Um, so they'll save the containers for me, which I actually appreciate 
because at like Thanksgiving and Christmas, when you have people over and people are like, oh, I'm gonna take some home. I, the last thing I wanna do is give away my Tupperware. So these are so beneficial. So instead of using my own Tupperware, I'm actually gonna use, use them for this. And they always send like the silverware, which is super nice because like, when you're like on a road trip or whatever, you know, there's like extra ketchup. Oh, this is jam. Like I have a little thing where all the ketchup packets are. Cause you ever run out of ketchup and um, it's like so sad. Anyway, sidetracked. <laughs> so I'm not gonna cut up the lettuce cause when we have the um, the lettuce wraps or the, the peanut wraps tonight, um, I will use some of the lettuce to make lettuce wraps and I don't end up using too much by cutting it and not having enough. So I've got these that'll stack up so that they're ready to go and I can have it any time. And I actually, and I'm hoping that with doing that, where's the cabbage? I have carrots, which I usually just pull out of here and eat, which I did last night. Oh, here it is. I'm gonna put this coleslaw mix in one of the containers. I like to add this to my um, salad or a wrap that I'm having or whatever it is. They smell weird. They smell like, I don't know what the, I have to rinse that one out. Anyway, I don't wanna rinse this one out, but I'm gonna put it in here cause so I can get to it easier. Um, but adding this to like a salad or um, a turkey wrap or whatever you're eating is good. So I'm gonna just put it in here so I can just grab these out when I'm ready to eat and I can just start fixing things. So this almost done. All right, so it's all done. I don't think I could have used my hands anymore. I didn't do all of the radishes just because I wasn't 100% sure if I'm gonna like them. So we'll just, you know, test it out. After tonight, I will cut the rest of this up. So we'll have the lettuce in here and then we'll have six prepped veggies ready to go. So like this, I could actually do the carrots or the carrots are fine in the bag that they're in. But like these, I can just pull out and get some vinegar or dressing and just dip them. But being prepared is what helps you and motivates you to stay on track. And my goal is to like use the vegetables and stuff and fruit that we have. Like so many weeks will go by and then I don't end up eating all of the vegetables. Like I have these up front cause I want to use them before they go bad. I didn't put all the coleslaw in there because we'll use that tonight for the um, chicken wraps. So I just left that right there. And what if there's any left and then I'll put it in the little container, but all of that is done oh that's not close all right so I'm gonna close that and then oh goodness I'm gonna get some dishes done which all I need to do is unload and load and then I need to go through bread and stuff and figure out what's bad um, oh there's a sweet potato as well mine's full so I'll just leave that right there um, it's chicken for tonight but these are chips for dinner I can't put them in the snack cabinet because everybody will eat them but I just need to kind of like go through things and kind of clean up and then get started on these beans. Hopefully they'll be good. <laughs>
get rid of this pan. <laughs> like, not even donating it, but look at that. That looks so bad. Oh my gosh. Like, I don't even know if that's like food or the pan. Oh my goodness. Ew, ew, ew. Oh, I'll fit my trash can. <laughs> that sucks. I am like down to. I have one in the dishwasher. I do know you're not supposed to put them in the dishwasher, but I've already done it. Blah, blah, blah. My next ones I will not. <laughs> but I have my wok, two saucepans, and I have two of these this one, and then the like the larger kind of like stock pot kind of one. So yeah, I'm down to like <laughs> bare necessities. Oh, goodness. All right. So we're late. It is 5 38. <laughs> So, <clears throat> I last recorded at like 11. Um, I was finishing up cleaning up the kitchen, which it's still clean. <laughs> so, <clears throat> uh, Matt was here. So, when he's off work, I have a hard time like doing stuff. Let me put this in the fridge. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Because he's here, so then I feel like, oh, I'll just lay around because he's here. So I did that. Anyway, so I went and picked us up some lunch and then um, we watched two or three episodes of Sons of Anarchy. So <clears throat> this is my tip. I don't work outside of the home. <clears throat> now, if you and your spouse both work outside of the home, I suggest both of you taking a sick day, like even though Noah was here, he was just upstairs laying down and stuff, but I suggest both of you taking a sick day and just like do nothing. Like the night before, like plan it out. Cause like the night before you could just like clean, have everything ready to go, like have school lunches packed, like do as much as you can the night before. So like that morning, put the kids on the bus, you take them to school and you have the entire day to do what you want. Like when the school first started, we went out and went to a movie and we did lunch one time or something. I can't remember, but it's super nice. Like his was kind of unplanned. Um, so I suggest that because we didn't do much. I did do the dishes. I did, um, you know, clean the kitchen and fixed all, cut up all the veggies and stuff. Um, but <laughs> we didn't do much after that. So we watched two or three episodes of Sunset Bay Angry and then when we were about ready to stop at like two, two o'clock, I think. Um, I, I was on Instagram or Facebook and there was like a TikTok video and I've seen them every once in a while. You'll see one that people have shared and I was like, I'm not doing it, I'm not doing it. Well, I did it. Both of us downloaded TikTok. So we've been on the couch since, well, since before like, like 12 o'clock. <laughs> we've been on TikTok for like two and a half, three hours. <laughs> yeah, that's what it do to you. Don't watch TikTok, guys. It's really bad. The shadow makes me look like there's something wrong with my chin. Anyway, so because we had, we didn't have a late lunch, but we had kind of like a, that's better, kind of a big lunch, we're not hungry, which sucks because then we're gonna be hungry at like eight o'clock. But, so I'll probably get, well, Hannah's eating a frozen waffle right now. Show me your waffle. My kids eat stuff out of the freezer. Noah will get frozen chicken nuggets. And if there's waffles, they'll get waffles. <laughs> Don't get that close. So. Um, um, anyway, sorry, I was reading a message. So yeah, that's about it. We had a lazy day. It's supposed to rain for like a, like a whole week. I think Friday and Saturday it's supposed to be sunny, but it hasn't stopped raining. My beans have been soaking all day, and my Instapot insert is Why clean, so I'm gonna like try to do that. Hard one? Maybe. Like hard I don't feel like doing anything. I've been so lazy today. I think I, I washed Noah's sheets earlier. I think they've been in there so Mommy. long that I need to rewash them. Mine. They're not cooked, baby. Leave them alone. This is what they Anyway, so I would say I'm gonna go find something to do because I'm not. I'm gonna get the kids something to eat. Why didn't you show me? You looked at it yourself. 
Wait a second. This one looks like it has blood. It's not blood, you know. Anyway. All of them look like they have blood. Okay. Oh, and I haven't washed my hair today. I washed it yesterday. This is how bad it looks. 24 hours later. You see Wait, this? look at this oh, one. This one that. looks cooked. So bad. This one looks cooked. They're not cooked at all. Anyway, I don't have to go to... PTO meeting tomorrow, dance Wednesday, and a PTO dinner on Thursday. So I'll be washing my hair every day. So I'm not washing it today. And if we go out with friends on Friday, I'll be washing it Friday. If not, we'll be going Saturday. So my hair is going to be washed every other day. It's just part of the bean. Don't put things on the floor. No. Okay. Let's go figure this out.